board to start by the stop. That's right. Okay. Catch and tip the sheep to be shown with as little stress to the sheep as possible. Then drag it to where it is to be shown by holding one leg with one hand and the wool on the top of the brisket with your other hand. The sheep should be turned to face where it will go when you have shown it, but today we're shearing for the camera. Place the front legs behind your left arm and stretch the sheep's belly out and hold the sheep firmly between your legs. Take your shears and shear from the bottom of the belly up to the top of the brisket. Then shear across and down the brisket and belly, making sure to finish with your blows. Making sure to finish your blows with the points of your shears near to the skin. Use your left hand to keep the skin tight, preventing cuts, and be extra careful when you get near the bottom of the belly not to injure the teeth. When shearing rams and weathers, take special care around the pizzle or penis and scrotum. Use your left hand to protect the teats and shear down between the legs, then step a little to your right and shear off the inside of the last leg. Place the sheep front leg behind your right knee and shear from the sock into the flank on the first leg and throw the belly clear. Place your left hand into the flank to control and straighten the leg so you can shear down towards the tail. Then step forward slightly with your right foot and slightly backwards with your left while pulling slightly up on the sheep's hamstring to roll the sheep up and shear well over the tail. Step forward on your right foot and clear the inside of the leg you have just shorn. Bring your right, right, foot, bring your right foot through into between the back legs of the sheep and starting on the top side of the brisket nearest you shear up the neck towards your left knee. When you are about three quarters of the way up the neck, let the sheep's head come around so you can shear the wool off the cheek and break open the neck wool. Start down on the brisket and shear up the neck and around behind the ear and over the top of the sheep's head. Use your left hand to set up the wool between the brisket and front leg and carefully shear off the front of the shoulder. Once again, use your left hand to set up the wool and shear the front leg, then remove the front sock if required. Take care around these areas as the shape of the brisket and front legs make this an area that is prone to cuts. Continue down and around the first side towards the backbone, slowly moving your left foot and the sheep into the position for the long blow, all the time taking care to finish with the points of your shears near the skin. Shear up the long blow. When you have shorn to the backbone, step over with your right foot, keep the front legs of the sheep off the floor with your left heel, and shear at least one line of blows over the backbone. Larger sheep may require more lines of blows over the backbone. Continue to shear as you step up from the long blow, and shear down in front of the sheep's ear, then around behind it and across the side of the face. Use your left foot to roll the sheep onto its back a little and shear down the neck to the top of the front leg. Shear down the shoulder and around to the front leg. Use your left hand to set the wool up for your shears and once again take care to shear the front leg. Clear under the front leg, then bring the sheep's head through and shear around and down the last side. Shear out the last leg using your left hand and again to set up the wool for your shears. Shear out the last leg using your left hand again to set up the wool for your shears and then straighten the leg to remove any wool left on the inside of the leg. Shear off the rest of the last leg taking care around the hamstring and joint. Use your left hand to pull up any wool that may have been tucked under the rump and finish shearing the sheep.